Writing is a skill, but self-editing takes your writing to the next level. As Michael Lee puts it, the first draft reveals the art. Revision reveals the artist. It's hard, though, to edit your own work, especially if you don't really know what the rules of writing are. Most people write because they're passionate about communicating their story or idea, not because they love the mechanics of writing. Their book is simply a vehicle to communicate what they want to say. Yet what we've seen in our years of publishing at Emerald Lake Books is that there are some common writing issues that can be easily corrected with self-editing. And as a publisher, when someone submits a manuscript that they've clearly taken the time to revise and polish, it creates a positive impression of your professionalism as a writer. Knowing the rules that you're about to learn in the Art of Self-Editing Challenge will make your writing stronger while taking your book to the next level and raising people's first impressions of you. Plus, it will make your work with your editor that much easier, saving you time and money, and will demonstrate to publishers and readers that you take your work seriously. And who knows, you may just find that you like writing enough that you go on to write other books as well, with more ease and grace, because you'll know what you're doing after you've applied what you've learned here. That's why we put together this powerful self-editing challenge. Each day, you'll learn the basic rules you need to know to solve common problems in your writing. On day one, you'll learn what self-editing is, how it works, when to do it, and why successful authors rely on it. Day two focuses on structure, so we'll talk about why structure is important, how to take your reader where you want them to go, what belongs in a paragraph, and why sentence structure matters. On day three, we'll focus on strengthening your writing by replacing weak words with stronger ones to create more engaging writing, hunting down and killing filler words, and silencing echoes in your writing. Day four is all about getting your openings and closings right for your book, each chapter, and each section within a chapter, as well as why keeping track of scene elements matters. And then on day five, we're going to get a handle on dialogue and quotations once and for all. We promise that if you come with a sample chapter from your current work in progress to use for each day's homework, by the end of the week, you'll see just how much more polished your writing can be, and you'll be eager to tackle the rest of your manuscript with your newfound skills. So we encourage you to register for our Art of Self-Editing Challenge today. We look forward to seeing you there. Bye.